stringing is an annoying issue in 3D printing. Filament gets damp is one cause that you can avoid easily. Today we will show you how to build a filament dry box. As you can see, it's 10% humidity inside the box, but 56% outside which is a huge difference, and humidity over 35% could get your PLA damp, which will cause stringing on your prints. Alright, let's get started. Here are the prints you need to prepare. Stand. The base. You can put the stand into its notches. And there are two notches on each side. A screw with a hole in the center. A stick. Two nuts. Looks identical. A printed hygrometer lid. A hygrometer with temperature and humidity. It uses button cell, cheap and easy to get. Alright, let's go ahead. First, install the hygrometer. Push it into the lid. It will protect the hygrometer. Then use the AB glue. Put some a glue inside the notch. Put some B glue on the bearing. Then put it in the notch. Press to make sure it fits perfectly. Okay, that's it. Then use a glue gun. Melt and put some glue on the stick top. Put the bearing on while the glue is still hot. Then put some glue on the top to fix the bearing. Just make sure the bearing turns well. Put the stand into the notches. You can glue the joints to make them fit tightly. It should be loose if you don't do anything. Settle two stands. Then the base is ready. Put one nut on the screw. Open a new filament. Put the screw in. Then hold the nut, flip the filament over, and install the nut on the other side. Adjust the distance from both sides. So the filament is ready. Then you will need some reusable silica gel. Get the orange one if you can, it is non-toxic. Put some silica gel into the base containers. Cover the lid. Make sure to cover it tight. So here is the finished base. Put the stick into the screw. Then put the filament in the base. Aiming the hole, fit the screw well. Alright, the filament holder is ready. It spins smoothly. You can lift it up easily, too.
Then you need a 5.8L container. Open the lid. Put some monkey grip on the hygrometer. Tear off the film. Stick it on the lid, push it to fix. Drill a hole in the container. It's usually on the lid or one side of the container. Once you finished, put the base inside the container. The filament should be able to roll smoothly. Pour some silica gel into the container. This will let you know if the filament gets damp. Release the filament. Take the filament out through the hole. You can also do this before putting the filament in. After that, put the lid on and lock the container. The internal humidity should reduce to 10% in about 20 minutes. You are all set. Thanks for watching. Happy 3D printing.